itself. not 
as good for my skin anymore, so I have to be kind of careful. But other than that, I love it. I think white wine was the move indeed.
story 
yourself. As you'll see in a second, they are no ordinary cookie. They are huge. You'll, you'll see. I'm just going to take you through the flavors one by one, but check the description down below if you're interested. They're all made in Hawaii, but like I live all the way on the East Coast and I still got them fine. I know shipping has been really weird lately, just, you know, due to COVID reasons and stuff like that, but I got these super fast, like way faster than I was expecting, so, you know, you'll be fine. So, this flavor is birthday cake cookie, so I can see it has sense of sugar cookie. It's got sprinkles. I'm gonna read you. Every cookie says the same thing in the back, so I'll read you this one. It says, what's in our cookies? We bake with the finest organic flour from Justo's Specialty Foods and Flour Mills of South, Fran South San Francisco. We use Hawaiian favorites such as mango, passion fruit, coconut, roasted macadamia nuts, guava, rau <laughs> raw Maui sugar, Kona coffee, and Hawaiian sea salt from the island of Molokai. So, it says Maui cookies and the pursuit of happiness. So, um, I like told the person who reached out to me, I said I would be so down to try your cookies, like literally say less. But I was like, I do have a nut allergy, which I forgot to tell you guys about my latest nut allergy episode. It happened on Christmas Eve. I had a cookie with a bunch of nuts in it and I like literally almost like couldn't breathe and had to go to the hospital. Anyway, so I was like, if you could send me things that don't have nuts, that would be cool. And she was like, don't worry, I got you. So I know that everything here, like I'm, I'm good with. All right, so this was the birthday cake cookie and everything has like the ingredients spelled out. So if I, if I didn't trust them and I wanted to read it for myself, I could, but I think I'm good. This one is called When Brownie Met Strawberry, and I can see it's like a reddish brown and it has icing on it. So we might try that one just because I want to see what it looks like. We also have Butterscotch Kisses. If you're into butterscotch cookies, also every single one of these packets has only one cookie in it. It is this wide, literally this wide, if you can see my two fingers, that wide, like this tall. They're freaking huge. Um, this one is called Cappuccino Cardamom. So that's gonna taste like coffee. This one is a grown up Samoa. If you're into those Girl Scout cookies, this has macadamia nuts, but I know I can eat those, so it's okay. But I was never huge on Samoas, I don't know why. This one is a red velvet cookie, which is a big favorite in my house. So, the birthday cake, I feel like that's just, I don't know, that's more on the plain side. I feel like we may need to go adventurous with it. I also don't want to get sprinkles everywhere, but this one is freaking, like, she's thick. She's, like, thick, thick, with, like, two C's. Three C's. Um, but we'll, we'll leave her to the side for now, so...